wrong, all right? Anytime you depending on another life force for your life force, that's a form of vampirism. And all world religions is rooted in vampirism. That's why they always talk about blood and they gods need blood. To please the gods of these religions, something have to die, something got to bleed, there have to be a sacrifice. There wasn't this way back in the prehistoric world, there wasn't all of this madness. This only came under this new world order with these male pharaohs. And to get back on subject, again, these different mindsets amongst these villages was battling. Male dominance versus the way of the old world, which never failed us, why fix what ain't broken. Eventually, the way of the old world was overthrew. This ultimately led up to two states called Upper Egypt and Lower Egypt. And what separated these two states was based on the mentality that I'm telling you. You had, at this time, based on all of these wars, no matter if you were saying, I want to stick to the way of the mother goddesses and the way of Ma'at with the old world, or if you was over here on the side of the villages that were saying, no, it's time for the patriarch to rise and the males to get on the throne. It really didn't matter which side you were on when it came to the fact that all males were sort of ruling during this time now because war had taken place. Anytime war take place, Males assume the key roles because we're the warriors, all right? We engage into the wars. When that happens, there's already chaos. So in this prehistoric time, you had males leading these villages saying, no, we fight for our mother. We fight to keep the mothers in the way of the old world on the throne. And you had males leading their armies saying, hey, you know, it's time for us to, to take over. It's time for a new world order. It's time for a world where males rule and call the shots. And these male cults were secretly forming themselves even during the age of the goddesses. When the first uprisings and disagreements came on the statuses between matriarch and patriarch during this prehistoric time, they had to already had to be meeting in secret. We're talking about prehistoric forms of Freemasonry right there and your males hooking up in secret to go against the mothers. Just like they doing today, your males hooking up in secret and, and they got the Madonna and child worship and they got the uh, divine feminine practice going on in the occult and everything, tapping into this mother goddess, the sciences that was taught in this prehistoric time by those oracles or those grandmothers, Mother Dear. You see Tyler Perry invoking this energy, Mother Dear, dressing up like the grandmother. See, when you look at the mother goddess, she's like a your, your heavy-set grandmother with all the love. 